Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so last time we were here, we did the beautiful unboxings of this gorgeous bag. So um, since then, I went shopping this weekend and I got some fun stuff. So we're gonna go uh, low to high. And then at the end, I'll show you the inserts that I sewed for the inside of my bag to protect it. And something else I picked up from Hermes. Just kidding, Hermes. So, um, or Herms, however you like to pronounce it. So we're going to get started. Um, we did the full gamut on Saturday, my friend and I. We went to um, Somerset Mall, we went to Chiji Max, and we went to Salvation Army. So we're going to do Salvation Army first. Okay. Ooh. So first of all, I got this Abercrombie & Fitch sweatshirt. Um, it's very cute. It was $5.99. It has a little spot here, but I think I can get it out. And then I'm going to upcycle this and cut out... A, um, a cute statement from my Cricut and iron it on so I have a, a cute little fun sweatshirt. Um, probably will sell this with the once I upcycle it. And then the next thing is um, every fall I go to this really fun event at the Grand Hotel on Mackinac Island and it's themed and you have to dress up. Rumor has it this year the theme is going to be 1950s um, kind of like Mad Men, um, Amazing Mrs. Maisel style. So I got this vintage dress. Um, it's super cute, has a metal zipper. It was $12.99. So it's a cute little shift dress and then I'll pair it with some sort of like uh, cream color faux fur uh, caplet or something like that. So that, we'll be keeping that. Then the next item is a pair of page jeans. Um, these are pretty much brand new. They have zero wear, um, if you can see. And these retail for like $2.29. They're literally brand new. So I'm going to try these on. If they fit, I'm going to keep them. If not, I will sell these on eBay or Poshmark or Facebook Marketplace for that matter. And then new with tags, jeans. Um, these are from J. Crew. They're the crop matchstick. They're also in my size. Obviously brand new, never worn. Also $12.99. Um, in Salvation Army, the prices, um, as everyone been, has been talking about, the prices are much higher than they used to be. Um, and you know, sometimes you hit it right where you get there on the day that certain things are 50% off tag sale, which is fine. They did have this really awesome Nike sweatshirt that was 50% off cause it was green tag, but, um, the size wasn't, it was like an XXL. So I typically like to, like to buy stuff. I'm going to upcycle it or keep it or sell it. That's kind of in my size range, either like extra small to medium, sometimes large. Um, if it's like a sweatshirt or sweater or something so that, um, I may wear it for a bit and then sell it to turn it. So, all right. And then TJ Maxx. So, um, I got a couple of these little travel bags. They were $6.99 to put your shoes in. Um, sometimes you're going to laugh when I like to travel with designer shoes. I don't like to use the designer dust bag because I don't want, if TSA has to like go through my bag, they'll just think they're just some random shoes in there, not really designer. It would take some time to look in there. And then I don't like the soles, um, the dirty soles to touch my clothes. I got this super cute little linen um, dress. I'm gonna wear it over a bathing suit. It's a size large, but I tried it on. I don't know if it's a kid size large because it's definitely not an adult size large because it is cut way too thin. It, it pretty much hugs right down the side of my body. Um, so not quite sure about the sizing, but um, I did love it. And then I got these really cute pair of pajamas I have the exact same ones and they're my favorite so I saw a pair and I got them it's just a cute little top um with some little matching bottoms and they're cropped and so since I'm so short they're actually like normal length on me so they're perfect those were I think uh yeah 1999 and then um got a couple packs of undies so just to refresh the undie collection and then last but not least I had a special order pickup I did kind of laugh. Um, the box for this was enormous compared to what is in it. So, um, nothing, nothing super exciting, but let's open it. Um, they were really, they didn't have, um, many box sizes. She said they're, they're running pretty low on box sizes and bags. So she laughed because she had to go up in the box in the bag for me. So this came from Hawaii. And it's a neobane bag. There's the front, and I got the special one on the back there. 
And it's nice because this is kind of water resistant on the inside, so I can use it um, inside of my new bag. So let me just pull that out, out of the way and show you. All right, so here's the bag. I'll show you the front. And I bought some orange felt. Well, first of all, I was looking on Etsy and on Amazon for a felt liner for the inside of my bag just to protect it. Um, and they were all pretty expensive. And this is my craft room. If you can't tell, I'm super crafty. I like to do things. So um, I went to Joann's and got a yard of felt for $4.99. And I just looked at some different patterns and I just sewed this pocket. It's got, um, this actually fits my cell phone. I put four of those pockets and then it has a center pocket here. So that goes in, I mean, and by no means, it's not like um, super fantastically sewed, but um, it definitely does the, does the job. So that goes in the front pocket. And then I also made a big tall one for the back pocket. And um, it actually has this little pouch in it because I had some some stuff in it, but I also did two long pockets. So if you have a long wallet, that'll fit in here. And then I have the big open pouch and then two more pockets here. So if you wanted to put, like I kept my little tiny card holder and my phone in this outside pocket, and then um, just kind of like some makeup and stuff um, in the big pocket. So the plan is to use that in there. And then instead of this little bulky square one, it's not really full because I actually changed my purse yesterday and took a bunch of stuff out of there in my other purse. So I'm going to put it in here so it's flat. And then I can put this pouch down inside here and it fits perfect. Um, and then it does give you the cute little pop of color. Um, if you were to wear it backwards, you could see the orange through here just a little bit. Um, it's kind of hard to tell on video. Let me see if I can get the light better. Yeah, you can't really see it, but on, on an in-person, you can see it's a cute little um, orange pokes through there. So yeah, that's about it. Um, we had a fun day yesterday, and um, yeah, I think that's about it. Uh, have a great day. Please like, subscribe, and share. Thank you. Hilarious. Okay, forgot. Bonus unboxing. unboxing. I bought a lipstick yesterday, too, so let's try it out. It is um, the Rose Hermes, and... It is one of the lip enhancer, it says, rosy lip enhancer. <laughs> Love the packaging, super cute. Also comes a little dust bag. And this is the component, has a nice little magnetic closure. And this is the shade. Let me see if I can get a nice little swatchy swatch. So um, it's really pretty. Let me try to put it on my fresh out of the shower no makeup look yeah so really pretty kind of sheer texture is great so yeah um little bonus unboxing for you have a great day